Hi guys, Dan's Dollars here, a very good evening to you all, I hope you're all well at home. Here we go then, £50 of 50p's in this video, as again, we are hunting for as many commemorative coins in one week as we can. Seven coins in the first coin hunt of the week, can we get adding to that? And again, we are actually aiming for 100 commemorative coin finds this week, yes you heard that correctly. And if we hit 100 celebrations we've tried it before didn't quite get there maybe this is the week that it is going to happen whilst we are finding hopefully plenty of commemorative coins we are trying to fill this book as well up before christmas fingers crossed the coin gods are on our side we're going to find it tough now with those olympics those rare beatrix potters but we're going to keep hunting. You never know. If you don't hunt for them, if you don't check your change, you never will find those commemorative coins. Again, today, though, is all about one coin. In particular, the new Christmas coin. The snowman makes his Christmassy return. Again, unfortunately, not a UK circulated coin. We would all love to see a Christmas coin in UK circulation. Come on, Royal Mint. Please do give us one. Talking of give us one, give us a commemorative coin find, please. Fourth bag already and still absolutely nothing. Come on, 2019s. Still nothing. What is going on? This is the start of a £250 bag as well. So maybe, just maybe, we're not going to get any in here. Again, always do check the backs of those shields, Britannia's. It looks like we've actually got, we got two right at the end. Final coin savers there. We pulled the rabbit out of the hunt. We've got the Paddy 2019. We've got the Peter Rabbit full face half whisker from 2016. Two coins from five bags. And oh boy, did we have to wait for those. The star find for me is the Peter Rabbit full face half whisker. Get your star find of the two below. That's seven plus two. Just about word that out. Nine for the week. Let's keep hunting. Stay safe. And as always, thanks for watching.